Now, in the last few months uh, and the last one year or so, really, most of the terror attacks in the valley has been perpetrated by a shadowy, faceless terror network called the TRF, the Resistance Front. Now, intel agencies suggest that this was an establishment put together by Pakistan after, in fact, the revocation of special status of Jammu and Kashmir. And in our next report, we get you all the details that we know about the TRF. A slew of terror attacks engulfing Kashmir Valley. All claimed by a faceless, shadowy terror network called the Resistance Front, or TRF. It all started with this telegram post on October 2nd, 2019. TRF claimed responsibility of a grenade attack in Srinagar. As ironic it may sound, the new self-proclaimed indigenous terror outfit launched itself on the internet while there was no internet access in Jammu and Kashmir. Offering the first clues on where the roots of this new terror outfit could probably be. But with no defined local leadership or hierarchy in the valley, the actual control and structure of this brand new terror entity remained a mystery. Intelligence sources claim that TRF was created by the Pakistani establishment in the aftermath of revocation of special status of Jammu and Kashmir with clear intention of using Hafiz Saeed's lashkar e -Tayaba. The new outfit provided an indigenous cover to Pakistan-based terror operations in Kashmir while providing a plausible deniability to Pakistan. The creation of TRF coincided with another Pakistan-like shadowy terrorist outfit and now extinct Al-Hind Brigade. Mimicking the appearance and operations of TRF, the group acted as a new violent Indian Islamic outfit outside Kashmir. The final evidence of a common hand running these two self-proclaimed indigenous terror outfits came from a Russian encrypted messaging platform called TamTam. -Tam. As both TRF and Al-Hind Brigade created backup channels on TamTam -Tam simultaneously. On January 3rd, 2020, former Pakistan Prime Minister Imran Khan provided the ultimate evidence of synchronization between these offshoot identity operations when he posted and deleted a fake video of purported police brutality in Uttar Pradesh. Incidentally, Imran's post came minutes after these visuals were posted with same claims by TRF ally Al Hind's Telegram channel. But what started as a Pakistan-sponsored cover for terror operations in India has now turned the old lashkar e -Tayaba with new identity and a modus operandi of target killings. We have a trend that even if Pakistan terrorists use pistols, whether it is Hyderabad encounter, whether it is Hyderabad encounter, whether it is Khanyaar encounter, in this case, Pakistan terrorists are killed. सारे के पास से पिस्टल मिला है पिस्टल से इसको कंसील करना इजी होता है मोमेंट में दिक्कत नहीं होती है और टारगेटिंग करना इजी होता है ये हम लोग के लिए एक इमर्जिंग नया थ्रेट है एंड द फेसलेस स्पोक्स पर्सन ऑफ टीआरएफ कंटिन्यू टू थ्रेटन द सिक्योरिटी एंड प्रॉस्पेरिटी इन जम्मू एंड कश्मीर दिस परपोर्टेड कॉल टू टारगेट पुलिस पर्सनल इन जम्मू एंड कश्मीर वाज इशूड बाय टीआरएफ ऑन द ओकेजन ऑफ ईद जब मुजाहिदीन मुरतद जम्मू कश्मीर पुलिस और इनके अहल खाना को अपने हमलों को निशाना बनाते हैं तो कुछ लोग इन मुरतदीन की मौत पर बदबकतों की तरह आंसू बहाने शुरू कर देते हैं मगर क्या वो लोग ये बात नहीं जानते क्या यही जम्मू कश्मीर पुलिस के दलाल मुजाहिदीन और उनके घर वालों को हरासा करते हैं सबसे ज़्यादा एस पी को कत्ल करना जरूरी है ये वही लोग हैं जो ग्राउंड लेवल पर मुखबिरों का नेटवर्क बनाते हैं द सिक्योरिटी एनालिस्ट आर ऑफ द व्यू दैट द गवर्नमेंट ऑफ इंडिया एंड द सिक्योरिटी एजेंसीज ऑल्सो नाउ नीड टू डेवलप ए काउंटर स्ट्रैटेजी टू डील विद दिस न्यू फिनोमिना ऑफ हाइब्रिड टेररिज्म दे आर ऑफ द व्यू दैट पाकिस्तान मस्ट बी हेल्ड अकाउंटेबल फॉर द होरिफिक क्राइम्स इट्स कैरिंग आउट इन द कश्मीर वैली With video journalist Neeraj Kumar, this is Sunil Bhatt reporting from Jammu for India Today.